got a uh, another box from the Funko shop over here. You sure love the Funko shops. Well, there's been some good stuff lately, so I'm not really sure exactly what this is. Hey guys, welcome back. It's Wednesday. Time for another uh, Funko Pop mystery box duel between me and Carrie. Yippers. We got some great boxes today from uh, Nerd Merch. Uh, they're 2.0 mystery boxes. I believe they were like $10.99 each. We uh, got eight of them. Mm -hmm. So, you know, after shipping and everything, $120 or so. Um, we've got a couple pickups from the Funko shop and something from Walmart to open. Heck yeah. So that would be a lot of fun. Yeah. So, um, you know, want to say thank you to everybody for the support. Um, if you're not a subscriber, uh, please do go ahead and click below. Maybe give us the thumbs up if you like what we're doing. If you really like what we're doing, click the notification bell to be notified of our next video. Yeah. Um, guys, also check out our channel memberships as well as our Patreon down below. Got some great benefits and uh, have some great supporters. So guys, also want to do a shout out to all the essential workers. Yes. Everybody. Things are starting to get back to normal a little bit, but in uh, some states, in some states, but uh, you know, thank you, appreciate it very much, um, all the support and everything during this time, and we appreciate all the essential workers supporting all of us. Yep. So, let's take a look at what we got over here to open. What do you want to open first? You want to open this from the Funko Shop? I okay. got a knife for you over here. Oh, do you? Yes, I do. Here you go. Is this the what showed up today? Um, believe so. Believe so. I just know because I got the mail. <laughs> <laughs> or for you guys, that'll be uh, yesterday. Tomorrow, yeah. No, yesterday. Yeah, yesterday, yes. <clears throat> this one is... Ooh. It's another one of the... I'm going to show it off. Um, pins. It is Rosa. It's the one for Mexico, the uh, pop around the world with the pins. You know, we're collecting all of them. So uh, that's the newest release from, uh, I believe, last week. Uh, it's Rosa from uh, Mexico. We're now on the second row. Yeah, we're on the second <laughs> row. The next one should be... Um, uh, Priya? Priya. Which is an elephant from yeah. India, it looks yeah, like. It looks like, yeah, especially considering the name. Yeah. Hey, yeah, pretty cool. Very, very cool. Pretty there nice little opening. We'll set this guy aside real quick. We got a uh, another box from the Funko shop over here. You sure love the Funko shops. Well, there's been some good stuff lately, so I'm not really sure exactly what this is. Let's see. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh, you got lots of <coughs> stuff in there. Yeah. We also, oh, guys, I guess we're going to have an impromptu. Oh, can battle because we have got a, a bat fink can we've got a speed racer we've got a, a wonder woman and we've got a, a peter potamus i love that one and then we've got a couple pops in here let me put this over here and uh the first one we have in here is uh let me open her up see what we got Oh, I know oh. what these are. So these are the ones that sold out super quick from the Funko store, guys. Here's Dexter from uh, Dexter's Laboratory. Um, everybody, a That's lot. That's pretty cool. Yeah, most people grew up with him. Oh, no. As soon as I saw the top, you knew exactly I knew exactly who, who it was. was. And this one was a really quick sellout. Was it really? Yes. Yeah, sold out like four minutes, if you oh, wow. know, that long. Oh, and this was the other one that you got with, you could get with it. Johnny Bravo, the one I really wanted. Um, this one also sold out super quick. Uh, apparently very limited this year because of yeah. what's going on. But uh, that's an awesome one too, guys. Very cool. Pretty excited. Well, I didn't know um, exactly what was in there, and we ended up with four Funko sodas. 
So it won't really necessarily be a, a duel or anything since we got different stuff. I but let's just see if we get if you get a chase or I get a chase. I took the hippopotamus and I took the Wonder Woman. All right, and I took uh, Bat Fink and Speed Racer, which are all fine with me considering I ordered them. <laughs> so I must like them, you know. <laughs> you like them a lot more than I do. I just think they're funny looking figures. Well, because they had those two I wanted to get and, you know, shipping. Yeah. The way shipping already works. So you're kind of already paying. Um, right. So you get kind of the same price shipping. I don't think I've ever even pulled a chase out of any of these. Out of all the ones we've opened, no, I don't yet. think I've ever pulled a chase. And I think that's why I don't like them as much. No. Pops have pulled chases all the time. That's nothing like odd. It looks like I got the regular Wonder Woman. She's not... She just looks like Wonder Woman. Why don't you check uh, inside the can and see what the tag looks like? Because I'm not really sure what the chase looks like. So It is not a chase. It is a 1 out of 8,400. Yeah, so that means there's um, 1,600 chases of that yes. one. Yes. Yeah. Well, guys, I got the Bat Fink 5,000-piece uh, limited edition. I'm going to open him up, and we'll uh, check out uh, if I got a Bat Fink chase. Ooh. That was the only other one that I would have wanted. Just because he's cute. The bat thing? Yes. Aww. Oh, cool. Here he is, guys. Check him out. He's bat thing. That's an awesome one. And uh, he is not a chase. He's just one of 4,200, but still super limited. And a super cool little... Uh, he's cute. Little pop guy. They're pretty cool. I'm liking, I'm liking the cans a lot. My next one is... The Peter Potamus? Yeah, Peter Potamus. I don't think this is a chase because it looks like it would just be the normal Peter Potopolis. Potopolis. Potamus. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Peter Potamus because he's a Potamus. <laughs> awesome. I don't that there's a, these were limited to six thousand. And this is a one out of five thousand. So that means there must have been um 1,000 chases, guys. Yep. So I got this one. It's the Speed Racer uh, Cola. Uh, it's the WonderCon limited edition piece. And um, let's see what I got. See if I got a chase or not from Speed Racer. Well, um, doesn't look like the chase, guys. Let's open the car. We're not very good at pulling the chases on no, these. No, it's one out of 4,200. I think just you've a, pulled maybe one or two chases. Just a regular one. Yeah, yeah. I pulled a few. I Have got, you pulled a few? Yeah, I got a couple. Yes. I got you the, did get the Skeletor. I got the Skeletor and I got the Frankenberry one too. Yes. So guys, there we go. No chases. Kind of no. a tie on that. And then I got this box we got from Walmart. <laughs> a little janky. I was going to say, I hope it's okay. Little or maybe janky. it's one item shoved in the middle. <laughs> Let's hope, right? Mm -hmm. A few more than that. Uh, yeah. Oh, I know what this is. Oh, it's what is one it? item. Um, I had pre-ordered this, guys. Oh. This is the Venomized Ghost Rider Pop T Combo from uh, over at uh, Walmart Exclusive on this one. That is a sweet shirt. <laughs> It is a pretty cool shirt. It's pretty excited about that, guys. I love uh You Ghost love Rider. Ghost Rider. Yeah, I love Ghost yeah. Rider. So we've got the uh we'll just open it up. I wish they'd make shirts in something other than black because we have a white dog and her hair sticks to So that's everything. a uh, pretty cool shirt, guys. Check it out. Very, very cool. And uh definitely it's got the Marvel thing on the uh, sleeve and everything. Very cool shirt. And um, it comes with a pop. Yeah, it's a pop tea combo. Yes. And then it's got a pop, which is in pretty good shape, believe it or not. And Fire! it's the uh, Venomized Ghost Rider. So check him out. He's pretty sweet and definitely one I wanted to get. Yeah, a little damage to the bottom of the box. but um, You see the one that is... That's okay, Venomized he's running. Storm. Okay. That's her. That's no, I was just... Storm. It almost looked like he was on a motorcycle because his hands were out to oh, the side. <laughs> So I had to take a closer look. Yeah, that's Venomized Storm. All right.
We've so, gotten through those boxes quick. So we've got these huge, uh, these this huge box from Nerd Merch Shop over here. Uh, we've got eight boxes in it. Not exactly wow. sure um, how they're packed inside. So let's open them up and see if we can go ahead. Yeah. They are in sorters, thank goodness. They're in sorters, so grab one. I grab one. All right. I grab one. And guys, they got their logo on every box. Pretty cool. That's so cute. Yeah. Now this one really didn't have um this one really didn't have like a thing of like giant hits or anything like that. Um it was just kind of pretty much good chances at guaranteed uh chases or exclusives and they said they had some pretty good pops. I tried to go back and look through to see if I could see any but I didn't. And um those are the boxes. So, yeah, so guys, finally, after many matches, uh, I won last week. Yes, you did. So now it's my turn for Carrie to dress up. I almost forgot. Well, our score right now is 9 9, so we're actually yeah. tied. And but we'll I won see last who... week. Yes, you did win so last week. So I got week. to pick out the costume or make the costume. I don't know. Yeah. So, guys, give us a sec. Well, hey, guys, I'm back. I'm not exactly sure where Carrie went. I've got this giant Funko box, though. Hey, there you are. Look at that, guys. She's a Funko box. <laughs> <laughs> you can't you can't deny my creativity, guys. <laughs> and plus, a couple of you guys suggested it in the chat. Maybe a Funko box. Yeah. So uh, here it is. Uh, Funko. Got a nice little Funko hat. Here we go. We're styling. So uh, let's get uh, ready to uh, open some mer nerd merch boxes. Yeah. All right, let's uh, go ahead and start off with uh, one of them. My first pop is... Bam! Ooh. It's a Michael Jordan. Yeah, it's a pretty good one. It's That's a North Carolina Michael Jordan pop. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That's awesome. That's uh I take it white... when he played in college? Yeah. And that's his white home jersey. Um got one of them right over oh, there. Huh. So uh it's a pretty awesome pop to add to the collection. Yeah. <laughs> All right, let's check out my first one. Doing all right over there, Funko Box? Yeah. All right, my first poll, guys, is... I'm going to get it open. Boom. It's a Human Torch from Fantastic Four, the uh, Glow in the Dark uh, Marvel Collector's Core Edition. That's a uh, pretty, uh, pretty amazing pop. Pretty cool. Uh, love this one. One of my favorite ones out of the Fantastic Four. Push my hat down. I feel like it's popping off and I can't reach it. <laughs> Mine. I asked her if she wanted to make the armholes any bigger. She didn't, so. We could have. I made it. I went crazy with the cricket, guys. Or the circuit. Oh, yeah. I went crazy He's with the circuit. He's been print. playing with it ever since. Yeah, you can't get enough of that thing. It's pretty amazing. I printed some Funko logos. I printed <laughs> some Beer to Pop logos. Pretty good stuff. My next pop is... Bam! Oh, wow! Mark <laughs> Hamill? Hamill. Hamill? That's Luke Skywalker. Mark Hamill. Oh, that is awesome. From Let me check that, out. that is the Mark Hamill exclusive from Decon. That's an amazing pop. And if I'm not mistaken, I don't know if it matters what I pull. It's my pop. You took my pop. Well, <laughs> I didn't want you to start claiming that as your own. I think that you guys in the comments below can, can quote me, even though she is not a Star Wars fan. If you even slightly mispronounce his name, you then lose rights to holding the pop. 
<laughs> I didn't mispronounce it. I said ham ill. <laughs> I just broke it up a tad. Guys, she's not a Star Wars person. I'm sorry. But that Mark Hamill pop is fire. I sleek away back in my box. <laughs> that Mark Hamill pop is fire. I'm super excited to have him. And, um, man, I think if he still holds even some of what the value was. I just whooped your butt. Maybe. I don't know, but. cha Came pretty close, I think. All right, the next one I got is, guys, boom. Ooh. Oh, this is a Gambit from X-Men. And this is just the common. Uh, not the glow-in-the-dark or not the convention exclusive. Just the, the regular common uh, Gambit. Interesting. Yeah. This is pretty comfortable. When I <laughs> rest my chin and my head on the edge of the box. Nice. Other than the fact it's hard to see over the tip of this. That's why I kind of well, tilt myself Well, now you know forward. how I felt as BMO. And how I felt as the robot where I was completely covered in a box. <laughs> At least I was nice enough not to make her head a box. I know, I'm surprised you didn't just uh, no, cut I a circle here. should have. I should have dressed her up in like a bucket full of glitter after that <gasps> stuff that covered BMW. Oh my gosh, I have been still finding oh. glitter on you just, what was it, Sunday? Yeah, I'll be getting dressed and she's like, oh, you got glitter. You went to go do your video for Monday. Yeah. And I was like... Hold on. You got glitter. You have glitter on your face. <laughs> okay, my next pop is... Ew. These seemed heavier when I grabbed them out of the box, hmm. just so you know. Well, some pops do weigh more than other pops. I just noticed that when I had pulled them. I was like, ooh, I want these. I got... Oh! Carrie got the I child. I got the child! Yeah, we've got, there's a child right above Carrie over there. Yes. Uh, probably can't see it through the box. And, um, yeah, well, when you're over here, they can yeah. see it. And um, I got a few other uh, childs around. He's a really Aww. cool pop, and he's definitely, um, one of, I think, one of the most produced pops ever. Oh, God. I I've seen him freaking yeah. everywhere. Everybody loves the child. But I think that's why they made so many, expecting that many people to only want him right yeah. well there's a lot more coming out no they make a lot of every pop really but he's very produced well hopefully now they're gonna All start right, guys. calling that down boom Ooh, i got the uh, black widow from a uh, marvel gamerverse and i have to tell you i hit this in a box uh, i was gonna say already, that and uh, i know this one has a really interesting value because i wouldn't think it would be as high as it was so we'll check that out in a minute interesting now you have your last box over there. Yes. I have got every single pop, guys, that I have gotten is Marvel. Wow. And guess what? Every single pop I got is not. I like these boxes. I just It is a random variety. Yeah. It's just weird how I got just a bunch of Marvels. My last pop is Bam Hamiko Toga. It's a My Hero Academia pop. Yes. Yeah, you special. have this pop. Yeah, I have a couple of these pops. That's the special edition overseas sticker. Well, the one thing I've noticed, it's hard to hit a pop you don't already own. Yeah, sometimes. <laughs> sometimes? You always go, I got that one. So that one's a pretty good one. I know it holds some pretty decent value. Can you itch this cheek? Oh, All right, guys. My last pull. What's it going to be? I can't reach my hand up there. Oh, wow. Ew. That's Thor. Uh, the Dark World. Uh, that's the Dark Elf. I know that that's, wow, that's a pretty good pull, guys. So uh, I'm not exactly sure off the top of my head of the value of this one, but it will definitely stay in the collection. And um, I'm not sure, but I think this might be Mark Hamill. 
I did not think they can make Thor cute. That's not and guess Thor. what? You just said it was. Th oh, it's, it's from, from Thor. Thor. Yeah, it's Thor. the dark elf from the movie. Oh, uh, yeah. he's cute. <laughs> well, guys, we're gonna get her out of this box. It's amazing. I, I dressed up in a box, a full box, and I was good to go. Well, we'll get her out of this box. You had to take it off to do the totaling. No, to take it off to do the totaling, but I didn't need my face etched or my hat readjusted or anything like my that. Head, my hat started popping <laughs> off my head. It would have been funny if it would I can't off. reach. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't either. Remember, I couldn't even open the boxes. I had glitter. So, guys, we're going to go tally these up. And uh, we'll be back with you in a second. Well, all right, guys, we're back. Yes, we are. Uh, let's go ahead and total these bad boys up and see what we got. Do you want to go first or do you want me to go first? No, you go ahead and go first. Okay. The first pop we'll do is the child. And he is worth $16. Nice. Then we will go with Hamiko Toga from My Hero Academia. I don't know why I couldn't remember that. And it is worth 25. And that's the uh it's the AA anime exclusive normally. That's the overseas sticker. Yes. And all of these prices are current. PPG pricing. From yesterday. Yes. And then we have Michael Jordan. Hold up. How much did I say the child was worth? $21. Did I? Okay. He is worth 16 Just in case I did mess up. Child is worth 21 And Hamiko Toga, you know, I don't believe you. Is worth 25 Okay. And then Mark Hamill mm -hmm. is worth... A whopping $37. That gives me a total of $99. Which, Can you beat that? Which is awesome considering we paid like 100 bucks for the boxes. I got it back just in my yeah, pools. Yeah. So my first one here, guys, Gambit. He is worth $12. Oh, wow. Really? The Human Torch to Glow in the Dark. Is worth sixteen dollars. Uh, the dark elf is still a great one, and he is worth uh, thirty-two dollars. Wow, really? And the uh, the most valuable one I pulled was the uh, Black Widow Gamerverse, and uh, currently on PPG, she is worth thirty-five dollars. It's weird because the chase is worth thirty-four, and she's worth thirty-five, but that's PPG wow. for you. So worth thirty-five. So, guys, unfortunately, that brings my total to $95. Cha-ching! Cha-ching! So, Carrie Cha wins by four. Um, I guess it works out better that way because the pricing on this, even on the Funko app, is weird. Yeah. Um, so, $35, but uh, that's what it's worth. So, if you've got them for $35, quickly run over and pick some up so then you can sell them because uh, $35, I, I don't understand it. But uh, yeah. the big news is... is this box that shipped cost us $117, $194 worth of pops. I say that's not bad. No, it's great. They a uh, great box for the first time. Definitely be coming back to Nerd Merch. Uh, guys, been a great Wednesday Funko Pop yes. Mystery Duel with me and Carrie. You um, made an awesome Funko Pop box costume. I did, and now you're going to get to see what Carrie comes up and... Uh, makes me for next week hmm. um probably will be more extravagant than the costume that cost me four bucks to make It'll well i had like two ideas it. last week right so, so maybe yeah, i'll so just go with the other one now I don't we'll know. see i don't know as long as it doesn't cost me 36 dollars in spray paint well like bmo cost me we do have a cutoff yeah. we're supposed to stay under how much it would cost for us to go get a costume Nah, nah. This one might be cheaper. All right, guys. <laughs> so until next Wednesday, when you see what uh, I have to dress up as, just want to say thank you for all the support. Please become a subscriber if you haven't yet. Yes. Give us a thumbs up. 
Stay around to see the awesome video that uh, Carrie has made for all our Patreons. Our wonderful Patreons. Thanks for supporting the channel. Yes. Take a look down below. Go check out some of our tiers. Uh, maybe even join the channel, guys. Some great benefits. Why not? But until next time, be safe. Beer to pop. And Carrie. Out. Out. There you go. Yeah, she's out of the box.